So ever since getting the original Apple AirPods, I've loved these earphones. I made a separate video, make sure to check that out, where I unboxed and I reviewed the original Apple AirPods. Now that was over two and a half years ago. I bought the original AirPods in 2018 and I've absolutely loved them. But the one problem that does happen with the AirPods is that the batteries uh, wear down or they degrade and the AirPods don't keep their charge. So after really being impressed with the original Apple AirPods, I decided to buy the AirPods 2 with a wireless charging case. But to be honest, I had an issue with that product. For some reason, I kept on getting audio glitches when connecting it to my MacBook Pro and I decided to return them. Ever since then, I've been using the original AirPods, but with the reduced battery life, it's really become a problem. And I've actually switched back to using my AirPods, the, the wired ones. So I finally made the decision to upgrade to the AirPods Pro. And in this video, I'm gonna unbox these AirPods. So let's see what's inside the box. Cool, so the one thing I do wanna do is I wanna try these on and see how they perform. So I haven't put these in my ear yet. I don't know which tip fits my ears. Generally, the original AirPods and the AirPods 2, that general design by Apple fit into my ear really well and I never had a problem with them falling out of my ears. I know there have been other people that have had that problem. So I'm just hoping that this is gonna work well for my ears, but it probably will because based on what Apple modeled the previous AirPods on. So. Let's see how this works. So I'm just gonna use, I believe these are the medium ear tips. I'm gonna give them a try first. That is really weird. It does seal your ear canal and at first feels blocked, but then the AirPod sort of opens it up to the outside world and you can hear your surroundings. Okay. Now I definitely cannot hear my surroundings. My ears are properly sealed with these buds, which feels interesting. The reason why the audio quality has dropped is because I was actually recording my audio for this video onto my iPhone and to test this, I need to use my iPhone. So here we go, excuse the bad audio. I've got the AirPods Pro in my ears. They are currently connected to my iPhone. You can see that over there. And if you push on here, you can get these three options. So there is transparency, which I'm currently on, then you can switch it to off, and then you've got noise cancellation. So there are your three different settings that you can activate. Then if you go into settings, you go Bluetooth, you can see my AirPods Pro are connected here. You hit the I button. This is where you've got additional settings, and here you've got the ear tip fit test. So I'm going to tap on that, 
and I want to know if this is a good fit for me. For the best acoustic performance, AirPods ear tips should create a complete seal when placed in your ears. A good seal will improve overall audio quality with deeper bass and richer lower frequencies. A good seal will keep noise from leaking in or out and results in better noise cancellation. So there we go. Let's continue with this. Ear tip fit test. Place ear pods in both ears so they're comfortable and secure. Then press play to test fit. So there we go. It played some audio and it seems to be a good seal on both sides. So that's awesome. No need to change the tips. I've got those spare tips for bigger or smaller ears, but for now I can just stick with the default medium ones and this is a very cool feature that they include. So that's how you do it. Here you can also change your settings for how you interact with your AirPods. So you can do noise control on the left and the right and you can obviously change these. You can also activate Siri, etc. I'm not going to go through this in depth now, but just know that you can change your settings over here. Interesting. Okay. I've just... Dis it started off with noise cancellation and it was just completely quiet, which was interesting. Now I've disabled noise cancellation, but my ears are still blocked and my own voice sounds quite strange. Now if I enable transparency mode, this is, yeah, interesting. I can now hear everything around me. They do a pretty good job, actually. It almost sounds like my voice is slightly amplified, which is different. I wouldn't say it's strange. It's just something to get used to. I can definitely see what they've done here because being able to kind of seal off the user's ear, you can create that complete silence and you can block out what's happening on the outside and if you add noise cancellation to that, you can add another layer on that and just let the user hear the audio from the device. But adding that transparency mode is actually really nice, so if one goes running or if you want to hear the environment around you, like right now I can actually hear the leaves blowing outside louder than usual, so it's definitely not the same and it obviously wouldn't be the same. Let me just play some music and see what that sounds like. Sounds really good. S similar actually to the other AirPods I would say. No major complaints right off the bat. So if I now enable, if I go onto the off setting, so if I switch off transparency mode, let's see what that sounds like. Okay, now my ear canals are blocked. It's a richer sound experience just based on the fact that um, the AirPods block my ear canal and I can just listen to the music. And now I'm going to try with active noise cancellation. Okay, wow, this room just became really quiet. That's very cool, interesting. So, uh, an even more fuller experience of listening to the audio, obviously with noise cancellation on. So it's sort of your three tiers of, of how you want to immerse yourself in the sound and essentially block out the outside world. So transparency would be, you can hear the outside world similar to, I guess, what the original AirPods would sound like. Um, then if you use off, that's sort of in between. The AirPods block your ear canal and it's, it's, you're more immersed in the sound because you hear less of the outside world and then obviously noise cancellation essentially silences the room and, and cancels any noise from the outside world. So that's really interesting. It gives one some, some good options. Um, I'm liking it thus far. I'm just going to switch back to the audio here. So there we go. That's it. That's what you get in the box with the AirPods Pro. I'm going to use these and test the different features and then I'll probably make a separate review video. From what I've heard, these are outstanding AirPods. That's it for this video. If you enjoyed the video, give me a thumbs up. If you want to see my future videos, make sure to subscribe. I'm Sean Toomey, wishing you an awesome day, and I'll chat to you soon. Cheers.